Miguel seems to think I'm mistreating him. Still, he's revealed the extent to which Catalina fears your quest for revenge. She has three death squads dotted around Liberty, whose sole job is to hunt you down. Act as the bait and get the death squads to follow you to Pike Creek, where some of my men will be waiting for them. Ah! Hi guys and welcome to part 69 of my GTA 3 100% walkthrough. Now we're working for Asuka Kassan again. Um, we're now in the Fort Staunton area. We've taken over. Well, the Yakuza have taken over anyway. Um, she wants us to go to Shoreside Vale. And um, basically we need to ambush some Colombian guys with her men by acting as the fishing bait. Basically. There's been a lot of different um, missions like this in the GTA games. It's quite fun. You just lure, a, you know, a car to follow you, and then just go into the ambush zone, and her men will take care of them. Her men are extremely dangerous, so don't worry. They will definitely finish off the Colombians for you in like one second. So yeah, let's get ourselves to Shoreside Vale. Right, I'm cutting the video here. This is ridiculous. I swear, guys, that bridge really hates me in GTA 3. I always seem to somehow crash. Right, let's um, get this guy to follow us. Um, as you can see, the pink squares now got darker. That means he's on to you. Just lead him to where the yellow square is. You basically just have to go up the road here. And then turn around, and then into this courtyard area. You have to make sure he really follows you in, otherwise he won't fall for the trap. So yeah, now go. You see, that is pretty dangerous. I mean, the Yakuza freaking thrashed them. They completely kick the shit into the Colombian. I mean, they're so deadly, Asuka's men. I mean, seriously. Wow. <laughs> it's impressive. Right, let's see if we can find the other two cars and give them the same fate they deserve. I forgot to mention that those are damage proof sentinels, so there are special vehicles in this mission, but sadly not permanently obtainable. You can obtain them, but then the garage will eat their properties if you try and save them. So I'm not really going to make a video response because, um, you know, they're not permanent damage proof vehicles, so they're not really worth collecting because you can't keep them. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry about that guys, but you just have to do. Okay, this time the accuser did a shit job. I've had to do all the work myself. It's not like it's a big problem. Now let's get the last car. Yeah, I think this next car is in Cedar Grove, or somewhere around that area anyway, because it's much, much further east. And there we go, it is. It's a very beautiful area, Cedar Grove, probably where all the very wealthy people live, and it's got beautiful views. It's actually where the LCS safe house of Shoreside Vale was, which is pretty impressive. Let's see if the Yakuza do a better job this time, not leave us to kill them. Oh, 
come on. I swear this game's glitching out. Because the Yakuza are not, are not actually helping me here. For goodness sake, this is pitiful. Thanks for the help, guys. You did great first time, but you absolutely sucked during the second and third attempt. Oh, this is pitiful. Now I have to go and freaking kill this guy myself. Not very good at. It's not a very good mission to be called bait if you have to then do this. Well. There we go, that dealt with the guy. Right, that's it for the mission, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. And see you next time. Okay, bye. Thanks.